So we're back with episode three, and this time you have the luxury of hearing my beautiful voice. So you'll hear me swear as I make all the misclicks and miss moves. So you'll hear that too. Let's go. We're ready to do this. Now I've got lots of mods on here, and uh, one of them is quite annoying. It's, Squad green to it's deploy. the uh, the load from character. I keep having to do it. <laughs> I don't think it's the mod's fault, it's just the way the game is. But I don't like doing it all the time. We've got the coordinates, but it's likely we'll have to clear out a contingent of hostile forces to make this work. <laughs> it sounds kind of fun because I'm only using my left earphone, so it sounds like I'm kind of having an earpiece now. Confess and enjoy a swift death. Menace 1-5, target coordinates incoming. Secure the VIP and proceed to the evac volume for extraction. So what we got here? Advent already knows we're here, yeah, so your something. position isn't concealed for the extraction. Well, somebody is. Okay, so it looks like we have just the nine. It's been giving me, like big teams recently because I've got a couple of uh, those um, faction things where sometimes you start with an advent, sometimes you start with a, 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 resistance, a, a, a resistance fighter. But this is kind of shit because this thing can't do nothing. So, I'm going to extract the VIP. How come we can already see everything? Well, most of this is strange. This is doing this, but it's oh, who's this? I wasn't listening to Bradford. <laughs> okay, we'll start with Duke. Rock on. Okay, it don't matter because it looks like they're tackling somebody else. So I'm just going to run up. I think. What a dance. You can see that there's nothing. Pathing confirmed. Now, if you've watched the first two episodes, you'll notice that we started like halfway through my Absolutely. campaign, so I lost loads of footage. No big deal. We're just starting from here. Um, uh, all right. But you'll see the way I'm, I'm playing it because I'm starting to play on veteran at the very start, and after the first five missions, I just thought oh, I don't want to play like this. So I turned it up to commander. And we went from there, and it's been quite cool. It's been quite challenging up until quite recently, which is why in the first two episodes you'll see me just run in and make some really stupid moves. Well, what I seems see stupid, that. but I just knew that if I did my normal kind of routine, everything's just going to be dead. And I actually needed to skulljack a codex in one of them, so and I ended up killing the first codex I saw. Um, so yeah, that happened. Rolling out. So now. We just kind of, we'll stay back a little bit with this person with no gun. And old Skirmy, we can use um, the grapple. Repositioning. Whee! Now this, per this one's named after myself actually, so I'm not going to give any more. I know if I go there, we'll get them. So we might as well not, because this is the last dude. Covering distance! I said dude, but it's a trick. Now, I don't have... Oh, I can... Now I can control her. I tried clicking on them before. What the f... You, you guys are dead, bruv. Isabel. Hang on a sec. What's going on here? There's two things there. <laughs> Maybe I should have got their attention because I, I didn't realise, I thought I wasn't going to be controlling this dude. But there's two health bars there. Something has happened. And you've got 100% on, on this guy. So you might as well just sap up something because you're going to die. Bro. But he's on, on top of the admin. Maybe I did get the admin. I didn't put him over here. 
already nine blocks over there because it's quite strong yeah look it's given me an elite lancer but it's put it over here which is kind of cool backup for this guy but I don't really know what's going to happen you're both dead bruv well I don't need you so just fucking shoot this thing one <laughs> how often this has only got 28 now when my team gets there come get some Who <laughs> 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 oh, right. See you later, Isabel. <laughs> I don't even know you. Now you'll notice with the mods I've got, I've got a lot of different classes which I've never used before, and they're, they're quite cool. Now the one who just shot somehow. <laughs> I told you, they're both in it. Ah, okay, cool. What do you do now? I forgot what I was just saying because something took my attention. What the fuck is going on? Why is this... <laughs> is he going to hurt me? I can't see him, and you should be able to see him, but I hope he doesn't hurt me. Anyways, yeah, the new the new classes, they're really fun. So this person, the shock trooper, too young. There's a story about that name as well. All, all the guys have got, have got stories behind them, not just randoms. I have named them all and loaded them from the character. Why is this thing... I've noticed that it's only got 20 All health right. now. How did this happen? What was that? No. I've just flanked myself. See, this is the way I'm playing now. I'm just not concentrating. I'm just running in, seeing what we can do. Because everyone's got really cool stuff. Apart from this one, actually. But look at that. Health and armour. No last bit of health is larger than the rest. <laughs> um, we could try this thing, but it destroys your own bloody cover. I can hurt this guy, but I want to concentrate on this thing. Um, so I'll tell you what I'm going to do. I'm going to run and go and get out of this fucking flank position. Only just there. Uh, it was my mistake. Okay. And that was as well. <laughs> I didn't know this person had that. That's one thing the shock trooper had. Which is good, because that means no more overwatch for you, buddy. Oh my goodness, yeah, we've got to hurt this guy. I'm... Yeah, I can do it now, because it doesn't destroy the cover from that guy, but he can probably run over it anyway. But I want to see this country! thing. Woo! Oh yeah. It doesn't really shred armor, which is no good. So I should have ran somebody else in. See, there we go again. Any good person who plays this game and had this team wouldn't have no problem playing on Legendary Iron Man, doing whatever they wanted. It's game time. We're gonna EMP bomb. Damage and disorient mechanicals. Okay. Whoa. Is it only mechanicals? We'll find out. Oh, we don't even have to find out. But does it shred? I think we're just going to launch a plasma grenade at this point. Because I know that that shreds. Now please, give me some feedback on this video, because I've never done this before. I've done odd bits and bobs and that, but I've never done a gaming video before. Even did a little round thing with the mouse there, just to... Okay. So this guy's cool. 
I always make the mistake of throwing him right out there, but I will comply. He will comply. Look at that armor. And he's got rocket launcher, which can hurt this dude as well. But it's got shit. See, this thing is rubbish. I oh, know it's got a fire in a straight line and all that rubbish. But he's got shredding too. He's got 96 on this weird guy. What is that weird guy? I don't know what that is. I think it might be turning into one of them weird things. But I don't know. <laughs> I didn't gain much ground with that move, but I just wanted to get up high. Because we got lightning hands! <laughs> I might shoot the weird dude. Oh no, there's that guy down there too. He can't see the weird dude. This is weird. Okay, lightning hands. Not there. I just noticed you. Come on, man. I know it's only one health, but often I take shots on this game and they always fucking leave them with one health, so hopefully that won't be the case now. If I shoot that guy. Um, I'm going to change soldier quickly. Because we've got some hoe. <laughs> and she's got a lot of shit. So the officer's got some good stuff. It's based on the advent officer, but it's so much better. Like you've got this leadership thing here, and it actually puts everybody in range in cover at the moment because she's tough at it. But I just want to hurt this guy. Roger. That's nearly a misclick, guys. Nearly a misclick. So I just want to fucking rip this thing up. So I didn't realise she's wearing the, the war suit. I didn't remember that. We got our little scientist dude. Um is there any some full colours on yeah. You stay there. And hunker down, buddy. Young Ho. Now Young Ho is a character I make in every single game that you can make somebody in. Because that's just Good, then I'm off. That's what I'm about. It all started in uh, third-person shooters, really, and, and third-person style games, because I, I couldn't stand looking at a man's butt all the time. So I just changed, and I thought, who do I, look, who do I want to look at? And thus, she was born. Maybe it didn't start in third-person shooters. It was before that, you know? Before that. Maybe Conquer 2.0. Maybe even before that. Oh, Jesus. But she's been with me a long time. You know, she's been Young Ho Shepherd in Mass Effect. Um, yeah, any char any game you make a character, this is the one I make. I've just done um, Divinity Original Sin Enhanced Edition with Young Ho and Too Young as well. Because you can make two on that, I like that. That was a fucking good game. I had to use a guide quite a lot though in that game. Which is not cool. I loved it. I love turn-based games. Especially when they've got a good story on them like this. This is mental. I, I, I don't know what they're going to do with XCOM 3. That's, that's going to be some serious shit. I know I've got run and gun, but I'm not going to use it. I just want to take this guy down. Really slowly. But I'm going to keep try and speed it up now. Well, you tell me in the comments if you want that or not. Right, she's got that implacable shit, which is pretty useless at times. When, you, when you're this strong, you don't need it. Oh, I've just got one of these, because I didn't have it for a long time. I can... No, that's a bad idea. <laughs> Everybody who's played this game did that the first time they got the skirmisher on one of them things in that level and died. Everybody's done it. <laughs> and I don't fucking blame you. Oh, look at that. One health, you see? That always happens. Now, this guy, free health, because he's got more armor and stuff. Um, maybe we can face off and uh, hurt them both. Maybe somebody else. 
So we've got Big Boy here. And he sees him and he shreds. We like. No rocket. So he's got no more armor. And something happened. We got an ability point. Yeah, I've been struggling with ability points as well because of the new classes and stuff and how much stuff costs and blah blah blah. Yes, I gave this person a Wraith suit. Really like the Wraith suit, it's kind of cool. Um, there ain't no big monster there now, so fuck that shit. I'm trusting you here. You know what? I think I forgot. Oh. Ooh. Do you know what? I haven't done any hacking because we're here to kill. And he didn't blow up. I definitely got I don't that know one. What, what the sort of whether it's an RNG on on the blowing up and stuff. It's a bit What's odd. over there? Otter's pocket. She's quite new, actually, to the made-up character side of things. My friend came up with that one. Well, I don't know if he came up with it, but <laughs> it's funny. So I used it. We're going to get 12, and he's going to die. Because okay. he's a shooting master. See, I don't look at these things over here all the time as well, because uh, it just takes up so much time. You know, it takes me about 45 minutes to, to get through the level and all the actions after until the next level. So, I don't want to take any more time from anybody. I know that I wouldn't mind, because I like watching people play this game, because it's so cool. But, I'm going to try and be a bit faster than I normally am. And it's going to make some clumsy shit, so you're going to see some shit. Hopefully no one will die, because... We're strong now, but yeah, no if that happens, I don't know what I'll do. Because I've had nobody die for the first ever time. No one has died. And I think I Certainly. did. Yeah, I did the Reaper mission and the skirmish mission at the start, and still no one died. I did really well. Good afternoon. Hostiles coming in from the sides. Yeah, I've got loads of uh, voice packs going as well. So everybody's got a little cool voice, and some of them are really cool. So the, I noticed this guy's not doing anything. I'm quite afraid of his punch. <laughs> oh, here we go. See, this is what I like. When the way I played the game the first time round, I, I knew what I was doing. I knew that I was gonna creep up the levels, make sure I only get one pod at a time and stuff, you know, and make sure I'm overwatching here, there and everywhere. But now I just wanna fucking run up and do some shit cause some problems, get myself in situations that I have to think about slightly, you know, in, instead of just making it that simple, simple playthrough that I did pretty much twice. So I could zip up here. Look how far we are. This was pretty close. We started like here, and the thing is there. But all the enemies have been right here too. This is cool. So what has she got? So Otter's Pocket, she's just a specialist. He's the Grenadier. I like the Grenadier in this game. They're really cool, but no one's really got any armor up there. Oh shit. Gotta change the angle for this. This is a bad angle. Don't usually change the angles in the levels, but this one's got this weird bridge and everyone seems to be under it today. It says, th oh, there's one there. I don't know what he is, but I'm guessing he was one of them because I saw two of them. But anyways, let's move in with my bad boy with his 58%. He's really shit at the start of the game as well. I changed him as well from my original design because I noticed that in the customization options they look pretty cool. Can you not shoot at someone with some armor? Oh great, the armored one is a big What? Who had the armor? Him. 82. Goodbye. 
mission level like critical. Um, right. Otter's pocket. I'm gonna use you. Shall I check out the hack? Yes, no. If maybe. you say so. If you say so. Alright, since she's Oh my. We're not gonna do the hack. <laughs> <laughs> Okay, so we got these two cunts here as well. So, these haven't been much of a problem in this playthrough. I've killed those pretty well. Him, he's whatever. I think we can deal with this. There's... Well, I should have kept those other two dudes alive a bit more, maybe. But anyways... I think we can do He's, he's, I should have maybe overdrive there. But I didn't realise we were going to get the other pods as well. Or the other, that last pod. And we're 100% on this guy with the otter. We've got these dual strikes as well because everyone's friends with somebody. I should really start using them. Because I think this is going to be it for this level. I think it said 11 enemies and... Yeah, they're all here. <laughs> um... I say we dual strike it. Then he's dead. Oh. I got it right. You got it right. Yes, you did. I like this. Let's see if I can face off against three people, or I can move in where the otter is and see a lot more face off and then yes got it because that's a fun move look at that four to seven as well it's quite good and i forget what rounds he's got i think he's got the burning now he's an eight i like this mod that tells you the things snakes are hard to hit to fire away but at least we got some damage on everybody with one dude, which is cool. Come get some. Now, I really need a wraith suit for him because look at this fucking shit. That is terrible. I'm gonna cover this side. What a dance. we can kill somebody or we can injure somebody even more what are we going to do we go backwards and select somebody else somehow oh do you know what i should have done leadership because it makes everyone concealed and it gives them mobility and they can move oh it's so far i'll try and do it on this well there's no need on this level but i'll try it next time so you guys can see that because that's awesome Follow targeting to make sure we hit somebody. <gasps> That's quite cool. Who can you see? Yeah, maybe one of them dudes because they're hard to hit. Or that 57, get that up to something else. Or we can dual strike this motherfucker. Oh, it says we've got a free weapon shot. Oh, it's because we ain't moved. <laughs> I say then, but yeah, it's not going to end our turn. Who do we go for? 60. We're going for the 100. And this guy's dead. I know there's a guy under the bridge and stuff I'm that's going to whack the that robot. Kind of girl. No, he's not. He's dead. And I think that guy's a priest, so he's either going to try and mind control somebody or put someone in stasis. I'm not afraid of him. The spectre, I'm not afraid of either actually, he's a faggot. Um, he can't do anything. Now please don't scream and shout because I use the term faggot. I use it as a, just a term to, for something I dislike. It's not based on sexuality. That's for another debate. 
Okay, so... 60... We're going to have to move. We're going to have to where the otter is. This seems to be the popular area. No one's got grenades, I don't think. Them snakes are shit. Oh, 82 on a snake. 82 on a snake. 7 to 9. We can do this. 9. Yes! Armor piercing really rounds as well. That was no problem. I'm going to use the runner. Oh, I might not need to. Oh, this would help a lot if we can do this. And just kill one straight up. What about the one we can't see? I'll see we do it. Fuck. That should keep you out of trouble for a spell. <laughs> No, it don't matter about this shit. What's this? We'll have some intel if I get there. Yes, we've got the fucking intel. We've really got anything. But that's worse. So, yeah, that guy's fucking dead. And Implacable Sounds actually daunting. helpful there. Okay. See, look at this maneuvers. And this is wearing the war suit, which is where the armor's coming from. This is deep, man. And she has run and gun as well. So, like, oh, imagine that shit. And we got a 60 here. I'm not going to go to where the armor is. Actually, I might as well, because there's three of them that I can see from here. It's the snakes. And they're all going to take shots at them, but I haven't been considering. So we're going to go here. We're going to kill a snake. Oh. We're not going to kill a snake. We're going to kill him. That was a nice fucking hit. gonna come in anyway. But what's this? Oh, this could be good if that hits. And there. But not there. 73 on a snake, 73 on a man who could go into stasis. I'm gonna choose the snake. Mm. I watched a few videos and that never works. I think it's just one of them things. I think we pull this guy in. Is he going to come in anyway? But this time we get a whack on him, and it's not that stupid light. Like so you ain't doing shit, bruv. And I'm going to shoot you in your face. Yeah. My fight will go on! I'm not afraid of you. Chain shot. 57. 72. So yeah, he's gonna go into stasis. He's poisoned. I ought to break a broom handle off in your ass. He looks like he's poisoned anyway. No. Someone has got viper rounds or venom rounds or whatever. Yeah, we can move in now, okay. Extra move available, do we want to take it? <laughs> no. <laughs> We're not going to this time. <laughs> Yay, let's play something. <laughs> yeah, I've got no overwatch and no covering fire, so someone's going to take a bullet. Or somebody's going to get poisoned. So what? And you are, and you are, for standing next to him. 
And is that area poison now? So I've got that restoration thing that I could do. You know what you get for poisoning my friends? I wish this person had like a punch. You wouldn't reach them anyway. Well, you can take some revenge. And shoot this guy. In the face. So he's going to die, so we might as well just move up. Yeah, I'm going to move up. I'm just confident in my abilities. Hit, hit, hit. Officers immune to poison and burning and all that shit. Okay, I'll go. Otter's pocket is obviously immune somehow, the specialist is. That's really good. I don't even need to use restoration. We just use like a medkit on this motherfucker. He's even got one himself. But the specialist does, and I think the officer has the other one. Should have did that first. <laughs> oh. So yeah, Mr. Scientist, yeah, yeah. I'm not going to go that far. I think we've got have a little, have a little stretchy legs. Now is that it? Because nothing's landed yet. Agreed. <laughs> I'm glad we agree on something. But I guarantee there's nothing. Oh, I'm gonna try and get up there though. Damn you. I can run and gun, get up there and overwatch, boom. That'd be nice. Turn on that. Let's see if this helps us get up there. <laughs> okay, so we can run and gun though. I'll show you overreacting, you bastard. I'll do my best. Okay. And then we can go up here. Oh, Aye, sir. Off I go. There's no one here. I'm looking forward to the challenge, sir. Is that it? Oh, I'm not gonna put you there. Come on. You can trust me. You know. Oh, fast fast probably. Go the furthest. Is anybody gonna surprise us? I literally think that was it. So it's quite good how it went down since they all came at us at once like that. But that was it over. Very A long run. Bad decisions. Good decisions, whatever you want to call them. Come on! <laughs> you got lucky in places, I'm lucky in some others. Oh, yes. Tracking route to target. I guess that'll be okay. You can just sit there. Mm. Who's doing this? Oh, it's you. Um, yeah, just sit there for now. Moving to Overwatch! Because we didn't move, we get that covering fire. It won't be the first time. I think he's right about that, because... Nope, it was the first time. Oh no, he was right. <laughs> get out of here. That's quite fun, even though he's poisoned. Oh, he wasn't poisoned, though, was he? We could cure him. Stand uh, next to him. Yeah, we can cure him with this one. Where's the one to get to? Give him a heal! Oh, he feels like he's Sure, I'm ready. Give him two hurt. If you say so. Look at that. Did all that with no misclicking. And I think Juki Boy can make it up here. Yeah. Somebody can't for some reason. Oh, that's why. I haven't utilized all the space. Advancing. But we've done it. Check that shit out. I'm not gonna hack it. 
because stuff. But we are getting out of here. I'm glad you're not damaged. Sorry, Isabella, but you're not coming with us. Firebrand, VIP is secure. Status confirmed. Mission accomplished. We are done here. That's quite good. Soldiers, yeah, see the Advent Trooper and Isabella. Counts towards us. I knew I should have done something with him. <laughs> I do like the pictures. Saving a few. I would like to assure the citizens of Advent that our peacekeepers will stop at nothing to prevent further attacks by criminal elements such as the one that occurred today. The elders have total faith in our ability to overcome any and all threats to our peace. So, Ginge. Yeah, although Young Ho is like my oldest ever made up character of any game ever, that Ginge comes from. Is it? Rimworld. Is yeah, monsters. we have to come up with nicknames on there. I was like, oh, Young there is kind no of a nickname anyway. Look at that, fucking 108 kills. A beast. So yeah, look. We've got, we've got the kills going. 108, though. I've never seen that before. It's because I've lengthened this campaign, you see. Is that it? That was the scientist who wasn't wearing that in the mission. What changed as soon as she got back? Considering the limited resources available to you, Commander, you have still managed to exceed my expectations. Maybe skipping a lot of stuff Excellent as well. work. Maybe. Maybe not. Who knows? We'll see when it comes down to it. <clears throat> if it's really cool, then I might not. But what was I doing? On this screen before that mission it was obviously getting Didn't I warn you about pursuing the Elder's artifacts? You're not I leaving me a lot of it's good to have them. I need and to get soldiers are oh. the ones who will pay the price. Mind you, there is a lot of the um proving grounds. Our no, is complete, still got a couple of bits and bobs in there. Oh yeah, Wendy Snipes Blade. And we got a clone trooper as well. Who's an awesome, Which is cool. We got a bit of Star Wars going on. Because every motherfucker loves Star Wars. Reduce Avatar Project Progress. No, we don't need to. I put it on like 50 so I could have a longer campaign. And it's been pretty long so far. I don't know what mission it's on. I'm, I'm, I'll find out for you guys. So we can have an ambush on this one. I've been ambushed a couple of times. And it, it's been a piss piss. Like, because the guys are so hard. You just make sure you put hard people on them. But obviously we can put a Templar in there. Which we have. Because we get... Sometimes things are taking so long now. That... Look at all this green. Like... Who's even, you know what I mean, no one injured, no one negative traded, no one training. Why is no one training? Is Madge the top? What is Madge? <laughs> A Magister? Yeah, this is cool, I guess. When I find that guy, I'm just going to shovel my money. That's why I did it. As soon as everyone good was, like, back to normal, I went in and took these two guys out. Before anything. This guy, the one you get from that, the, the woman. I forget her name. She's a dick. But, yeah, I took her out before even the Black Sight Vile mission. I was like, yes, we can do this took some of my soldiers out but 
we did all right because of the new uh, classes they've been helping me out so much the necromancer I love as well you'll see that one um, and you'll notice that most of them are girls because I like looking at girls Hunt the chosen so yeah we're gonna do this we need a major shouldn't be a problem who do we put out there so this guy we saved so I don't really use that one and it's a woman called Jordan she's from Canada eh so I'm gonna put someone who we used in the last mission so I have to use somebody else for the next mission so you guys can see someone else um, who? I like having a specialist, but we don't always need them. So, you're at the top of the list, there you have some will. And another soldier. Who's your, who's your pal? Do you know what I'm going to do instead? These green ones. And these blue ones. So, furry growler. And this person, who I think we saved as well, but they were an officer, so I thought, oh yeah, spare one of them would be good. I haven't really got a name for this person. I could change the gender and then maybe open up some more name choices, but that was her, we saved her, she's cool. And Buki, who smokes a cigar. I think we can do this. Part three as well, like my followers will lead this action this time. to victory. Maybe not the next episode, but the one after could be that one. Mother, mother, oh yeah. Oh, maybe she was injured. That's why she went training. Soul steel, and we can do some more stuff. Oh, yeah, I like this one. Yeah, look, that other one must be the top, because that's it now. That's cool. What we got going on here? See, this is the thing I was just talking about. There's some stuff here. We got this blank mod. Now, I don't know what it is, but we got the splice, and it's instant. So what do you get? You get a hat with a knife in it. And maybe an alien hunting license. I don't know. I'm going to go for it. We've got it. And it's disappeared. Oh, no, it's there. We've definitely got it now. And it's changed. No, it might be this, this one. See, there was another one as well. Don't know what the hell that was. Obviously, I got the two extra squad size things. Reaper. And now the Gorilla Tactics School is finished. Won't even tear it down. <laughs> so yeah, 18. I've always been able to have people this campaign. One time it went down to eight. But I think I can only bring six out on a mission anyway. For a second there, because I've been having a rule like up. With all of if there even a tiny bit missing some will, I, I don't take them. I take the next person. I and I thought that would cause me problems, but it's been okay. And of course, their so anyways, always I'm... Seem to revolve around experimenting on us. Do you know what? I'm talking so much because I haven't talked on the other ones, so I'm pretty much catching you guys up. And the rest of the, the thing is gone, you know. So we're catching up with each other, and we just got some more supplies that we don't really need. Is there anything... Just give the word and I'll get started, Commander. Ah... Uh... See, I have the adept staff, and yeah, we do. We do. See, we don't need any supplies now. And you know what? The, the, the research is running low as well. I think we just got the uh, the shadow chamber. But I think as I tried to point out in the last mission by doing this, and then going back to the thingy and showing you the mission, we can't do that yet for some reason. And it says all other shadow projects must be completed before undertaking 
this research. And I've done all that, obviously. But we got a mission earlier, which was from the Codex Brain, that I haven't done yet, because we're doing everything in a weird order. Or maybe I did. No, there it is. See, look, the Codex Brain. And I think once you do that, you might get another Shadow Project thing that comes up when you have to do that before the Avatar one. So we're, uh, we're ahead of ourselves a little bit. So we've got to make contact with Indonesia. And we needed the intel before, so I think now we've got the supplies, I think that's what we'll do. I've just lost where I was. There we go. <laughs> where do we go then? Should we do it? Yeah. That's what we do. Setting course for Sector 16, Indonesia. to establish local regional See, keep contact. These now. This will That's prove to have getting. been an important breakthrough. Yeah, but what is it? <laughs> See, I can't do anything else or as well. I will make that our highest priority. What's this? X-C-O-M! What's that spell? X-Com! <laughs> That's right! Another win for our guys and girls in black! Making the elders miserable one day at a time! If you happen to come across one of our bad friends, I swear we have sure them, you thank them for their service. It's saying we don't. So I'm gonna believe them. But if anyone runs from a mech again, even though they're like a colonel, I'll be disappointed. It says we've got new stuff in the black market, but there's one new. And I thought like putting it up to Commander would make more stuff. Commander, the aliens continue to make I progress on the Avatar project. If we're going to slow them on, down, we'll need to move fast. Random. Well, this is cool. We might have some tired people that we have to swap out. We don't need supplies, and it's a hidden event, which I couldn't afford at the time. Um, whatever. Guarantees reinforcements. See, that could be cool to keep. Enemy tech and psionic defense are doubled. Now, the intel is what I need, because I've got to make contact with a few other places yet. Everything else, yeah, I'm just going to go for what I need. At least it's something that I need. You know, we've got... we got some blue screen rounds that could sort this thing out and, and make it a lot easier for us. So, Setting yeah, course for Eastern European Ward. Dun, 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 and we're there. Oh yeah, you guys missed the UFO and all that shit. But to be honest, it was the worst UFO mission ever. It was literally two moves away. Like two normal moves, no run and gun. I took two moves and somebody could fucking see the, the thing that was keeping the UFO down. And you know what that means when you've got a sharpshooter with squad side. You just shoot and you win and you run. So I took out a few reinforcements and it was over. It was a very, very quick mission. But we're going to try and make some more magic as the time comes. So for now, we're going to remove all of these guys. And I will see you next time on the flip-flop. <laughs> because we're ending here. Good night.